Hello guys, today's video is on why everyone, and I mean literally everyone, should lift weights or do resistance training. Now before we go anywhere, stop what you're doing. You hear me? Stop. Okay, are you stopped? Now listen to me. This video is going to be important. If you don't already lift weights, you are going to be so glad you watch this video. So watch through the whole thing, hear me out. This is important and I guarantee you'll be happy that you listen to it and it will help you out if you don't know it already. But anyways, let's go. Now, when I say everyone, I mean literally everyone. I think everyone should lift weights or do some sort of resistance training unless you're a really young kid. And for kids that are not in their teens, when you're in your teens, then I think lifting weights and resistance training is good. But before then, uh, if you do anything, just focus body weight exercises and maybe take up a sport so you can build coordination and balance before you then get into the resistance training and lifting weights. Now, I don't mean everyone should just be pounding out heavy weight. Like, I don't mean everybody should go lift weights, like legitimately go bench press 225 or deadlift 315. I mean everyone should be doing some sort of resistance training that fits them and is uh, within their capabilities. So I'm not saying an old grandpa or an old person should be going over and try to deadlift 315. I'm just, I'm saying resistance training that fits that individual person's capabilities and there is some form of resistance training that fits everybody's capabilities, literally everyone's. One thing I want to address, and I see this all the time, I hear it all the time, is one common fear of lifting weights or resistance training is that you're going to get bulky, get bulky or big. Um, this is commonly from girls. So if you're a girl, listen up. I'm glad you made it this far. You're at a good point and I, this is going to help you so much. I guarantee it. So girls and a lot of people, you feel like you're just going to get huge or big from lifting weights. And that's simply not the case. I, you would be surprised if you think this, how many people, oh, there's tons of guys who are trying to put on muscle, get big muscles and put on weight, but can't. It's not that easy, and if it could, I'd be freaking jacked, like huge, huge, because I've been working out a long time. It just doesn't happen that easily. You don't have to be afraid of being bulky, because at most, at most, you put on like a centimeter, maybe. Like It would not change anything that drastically. I promise you will not get huge, especially if you train the right way. All right, so let's get into why I say this, why I think everyone, literally everyone, should lift weights or do some sort of resistance training. I'll give you all the reasons I think resistance training is the best and I'm not alone in this. There's some multiple studies. If you ask any other trainer or fitness guru, whatever, they would say the same, I'm very confident. So reason number one is that lifting weights, doing resistance training boosts your metabolism. So that means it boosts how much calories you burn on a daily basis without even doing anything. So if you're lifting weights, it just boosts how much calories you burn even when you're not lifting weights. So your overall calorie burn is being boosted from lifting weights. So if you want to lose body fat, why would you not want to do something that makes you burn more calories even when you're not doing it? So if you lift weights, you burn calories while you're working out, obviously, just like all exercise. But then lifting weights causes your calorie burning to continue and increase overall throughout the rest of your day when you're just when I'm sitting here because I'm lifting weights um, my uh, metabolism is boosted and calories are being burned more so if you want to lose weight which is a common thing I understand losing body fat one of the best things you can do is start resistance training because you burn a lot of calories doing it and it boosts your metabolism which is what like everybody wants so that's a big big thing that I think everybody needs to know and realize how like, wow, that's pretty awesome that lifting weights resistance training causes a boosted metabolism. Okay, reason number two is that it builds strength. Lifting weights, doing resistance training builds overall strength. Not just in your muscles, but for your whole body because your muscles, their job is to support and protect the skeletal system, your bones. So lifting weights improves your overall strength in this uh, makes your muscles stronger and supports your bones, makes your bones, joints stronger, overall your whole body stronger so it's more resistant to injury and whatever, it's just, it's tough. You become tough and strong, which is good for everybody, 
being strong. And just because you're being strong doesn't mean you're bulky. There's a lot of people who don't look that big but are strong. Like dads or like parents. Like There's such thing as dad strength. Like Yeah, they might not, not look like they're very strong, but they have dad strength. So strength does not equate to size, okay? Um, lifting weights builds overall strength, which is very important for your body and your bones and everything. Number three is that lifting weights and doing resistance training, you can sculpt your body. So that means you can make, I want bigger arms, I do more curls. If you want a bigger butt, you do more butt exercises. You can literally train whatever body part you want to grow, to make bigger. You get to sculpt your body. And you can lose body fat overall. You can't get it in any spot. That's impossible. But you can lose body fat, like I said earlier, with a boost of metabolism to increase your calorie burn. And then you build muscle in areas to sculpt your body how you want it to look. I mean, at least me, I love doing that. I mean, there's spots like, man, I want to work on my traps. So I'm going to work on them and I can sculpt my body how I want it. You can literally change yourself and make yourself look how you want to look. It's possible and you can do it by lifting weights or resistance training. Number four and a great reason that I love lifting weights and resistance training is because of progressive overload. So progressive overload means you just consistently add weight or make it harder and harder on your body, like overloading your muscles so they have a signal to grow or to change, like telling your body, oh, it's getting tougher and tougher consistently, you gotta continue to change. And with lifting weights, you can do this forever because I, the, you can't run out of weights to lift unless you need to buy more, but you can just keep adding weight so this kind of prevents plateaus and you can always make progress continuously and continue to make it hard on your body without ever like losing the benefits because you can progressively overload and lifting weights and resistance training does this better than any other form of exercise I've ever heard of. So basically, lifting weights and resistance training is like eternal because of that progressive overload just makes it an eternal exercise that you can just keep doing and getting better and better and improving and going up the whole time. Number five, a reason I think this is so great is because you don't have to do it every day. I mean, personally, I do it every day, but if you just do it like two times a week, couple times a week, maybe even once a week and you hit it hard, you can see all these benefits. Like even just a couple times a week of resistance training, strength training, weight training, lifting weights, it can give you all these benefits. It doesn't take so many hours in the gym to do. You can do it just a couple times a week. Number six is that it keeps the body mobile and functional. So lifting weights and doing these exercises causes you to utilize your full range of motion. If you're doing it properly, you're gonna have full range of motion. And this just like, it tells your body, oh, this is, we still need to be able to do all this stuff. So if you have that full range of motion, you're more mobile because you use it and it's loose. And then this just causes the whole body to say natural because you're using the whole body. It set, makes your muscles and bones like stay how they should be, like able to move. And it just helps to be mobile for the whole body. Number seven, and the last one, is that it boosts your mood. This is pretty important for everybody. All, okay, this is all forms of exercise. Boost your mood and can help you be happier. And this is because of endorphins. I'm sure you've heard of endorphins that get released when you exercise. Your body releases them and it's basically happiness. It makes you feel really good and it's great to fight mental health conditions. Like, not necessarily fight, but Lifting weights in all forms of exercise boost your mood and help make you happy so this is, can combat or like help uh, kind of numb or like take away the symptoms of mental illness or something. Uh, it just makes you feel really good. Um, I'm sure you guys have all done it or noticed it if you've tried it, but I love it. It feels great, makes me happy. So lifting weights in all forms of exercise can boost your mood and make you happy. Now I hope I have opened your eyes. If you weren't already lifting weights or resistance training, I hope you made it through this whole thing and really learned and understood the importance of all this and how great it is for everyone because it's not gonna make you bulky. Just because you lift weights doesn't mean you get big. Otherwise, every guy who's ever done it would be big. It doesn't work that way, I promise. Trust me, just try it. And it, it does all these things. You have nothing really to worry about because it can, it can be unique to you. There's no shame. You can do whatever resistance training you want to. And there's so many benefits. So I really hope you got, you like comprehended that from me and you give it a try. I would love to see you give it a try and uh, just see what happens. I mean, even if you just want to give it a try, nothing bad is going to happen in a week or a month. Like you can only see benefits like 
it just be so good for you and I hope you try it. And if you wanna try it, you want my help, check out my website linked down below. I offer workout programs and personal coaching. I can make you a custom workout program. And there I can give you programs that I believe and I've tested that they work and I like them a lot. They can help you and it's a good place to start if you wanna try it. And uh, if you have any other questions, you can just DM me or comment down below. I'll answer them as soon as possible. I just want to help you guys and I want everybody to be healthy, be happy, and just enjoy life and like really reap the benefits of resistance training and lifting weights because there's so many for literally everyone. So I hope you liked the video. I hope this helped. Hope you made it through the whole thing. If you did, I'd really appreciate if you gave it a thumbs up um, and then subscribe, hit the bell icon, and share with your friends. Share with anybody who like once you get this knowledge, just share it with people because there's so many people that don't realize the benefits of it and I just hope it can reach more people and just help everybody. So thank you for watching. That's everything. I will see you in the next video. I love you guys. Have a great freaking day.